on military power, it's, uh, if, if we were a, a functioning political union, not only do we have around two million soldiers uh, uh, under arms, we actually have nuclear weapons as well. Uh, and our combined defense budget uh, is, um, if, um, um, if I'm right, bigger than China, India, and Russia combined. But again, it is not used the way a superpower would use it. Where we have an advantage over the United States is that we are territorially an unfinished project. So people, countries are still knocking at our door. And enlargement, the promise of enlargement, is one of our most effective tools. And, um, and that's why I believe that we should exercise our power, such as it is, primarily in our neighborhood. Today we pass sanctions on Iran, Syria, and Belarus. If we can't fix our neighborhood, then clearly we'll not be able to act globally. Herman Van Rompuy's um, term of office was extended two weeks ago. I bet you most people in this room didn't notice. Uh, whereas we need uh, a leader of Europe that would be elected either by the European Parliament or even more broadly than that to really um, uh, to be able to move things in Europe and to speak on behalf of Europe. Thank you. When are member states finally going to wake up and realize that we cannot continue in this way that we do it member state by member state? What few people know is that Europe has more soldiers under arms than the United States. We have about 2 million men and women in uniform to the Americans 1.4, I believe it is, 1.2, 1.4 million. We spend only 60% of what the Americans spend on their soldiers. That means that we get much less bang for the buck. I mean, we are much less effective. The German armed forces, for example, was about 250,000. But when 8,000 were deployed, the entire system was creaking already. Huh? So the issue is we really need to get our act together. What can change that? One, and there, Charles, yes, you may be right that uh, the austerity measures are going to make it more difficult to, to increase defense spending. But it may also lead to a recognition that more cooperation is needed. 